Hey guys, welcome back to Fun Time. Today we will be doing an science experiment. Yeah, so this is um, Einstein box Earth and Crystal Science Kit. It's an ultimate science kit. We ordered it from Amazon, and we're Einsteins. Yeah, we are. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So this is inside the box. We can see we have a lot of chemicals. Yeah, vinegar, baking soda, citric acid. And we have a food dye, red food color, blue food color, rose food essence, crystal activator, and glow powder. Here we have crystal mix, baking soda, and crystal powder. So now let's take a look at what is inside the toolkit. So this is what is inside the toolkit. I'll be explaining it to you. We got some cup. We got one cup. Actually, we got two cups. We got a funnel, cute little red funnel. Our measuring cylinder. This is a mini volcano. We got our, sorry, this is a mini waterfalls. This is a mini volcano. And this we have is a snowman mold. We have a dropper, which we won't be really needing. And we got our spatula. And last but not least, we got our tray. So, yeah, let's get started. So, along with the kit, we get two instruction manual. One is a bonus manual, and one is the actual instruction manual. So, as you can see, this is our manual. If we open it up, first we have is the index where we have all the activities in this one so now i'm just going to show you a short tour this is all a few of the examples and here we have detailed instructions so yeah and for the bonus manual this is the simple bonus manual nothing much yeah that's the index i guess yeah so now we both will find out a fun activity, right? Yeah. So this is the experiment number two, which we'll be doing today. Infinite it's bubble lava. So read it out. So these are the instructions and these are the material. So let's see what we all need. A mini wall canal, a tray, measuring cylinder, spatula, cup, and funnel. Materials from kit. Baking soda, citric acid, and red food color, I guess. Materials from home. Liquid soap or dishwashing soap and water. Sorry, these are all the equipments. This is citric acid. Baking soda. Some red food color. And I have water. Some soap, a mini wall kit, a spatula, and a funnel. Two cups. Okay, it's just a cup. And a measuring cylinder. And last, we have the tray. So, guys, now let's get started. So, we sit down right here, and here's the manual. An instruction manual. So let's start. Do you mind reading the first one? Okay. So take a cup. Okay, we have our cup here. Take it. And add two scoops of baking soda. Okay. So now my brother will add two scoops of baking soda. So okay. Okay, then add. So we have to add it in the cup. And if you want, you guys can replicate this except for the mini wall canal. You can use like a tall cup. Two scoops? Yeah. So that it will be one. Show them how much the scoop is. This much. You can use like tablespoon. You spill some on the floor. It's okay. Okay, I added two scoops. And we can close it up. So the next says... And add one scoop of citric acid to it. So now my sister is going to add one scoop of citric acid. So guys, we have our citric acid. And uh, instruction now. So just don't worry you. guys, this acid is not irritant. This is just a normal acid. Is it non-toxic? Yeah, 
many people might have this in their house like you can find it at your normal store okay so one scoop okay show them how it's much how much it is is this good enough yeah no? so i'm gonna add like this much i'm gonna add it in okay now let's close it up what's next next we have mix it well okay so now my brother will mix it in well okay show sorry mix it in well okay mixing it in satisfying sound I guess I'm done with mixing. Okay, so now we have to take our mini walk can out. Put it down. It's, it's so cool, guys. You even have school ridges. It's not tiny. It's huge. See, there's a hole. Okay. I don't think the viewers can see that. Yeah, see, my finger can go in there. <laughs> okay, so now, now we'll put, I'll put the funnel on and now... Why don't you pour it in? Okay, so I'm going to keep the uh, mixture. Just I'll put it near so you guys can see. You can, as I said, if you don't have like this mini wall canner, uh, you can simply use a tall uh, tumbler or something like that. Okay, why don't you read the next instruction? Okay, put the mini wall canner on the tray and place the funnel on top of the wall canner. Then pour the mixture into the wall canner, okay. which we already did right now. Add 5 ml of liquid soap and 20 ml of water into the measuring cylinder. Okay, so 20 milliliters of water, right? Liquid of soap. 20 milliliters yeah, yeah, yeah. of soap? No, no, that's water. Okay, so I'll do that real quick. So you can see, I don't know if you can see the measurements. But I have 20 ml of water. Now I'm going to add 5 ml. So this line right here um, is 20. So the next line will be 5 ml. So let's add it in. So right now I added it. I'm gonna mix it in nice and well. Okay, I just came back. There. It looks like it's cloudy right there. Yeah, it's actually shiny because I have this sort which is really shiny. So it's glittery up close. I don't know if you can see it on camera. And the next step is mix the contents to make a soap solution. Did you do that? Yes, we have made a soap solution. Now. Add five drops of the red color to the soap solution and mix them well. So do you want to add them? Okay, sure. So I just got some red fit color and I'm gonna add five drops. Okay, oh, one, so one, two, two three, three, four, five. five. So without, if you don't have fit color, you can use paint and you're gonna mix it well. If you, um, I'm just gonna use red. You can use orange, yellow, or if you wanna make, you know, why not even a pink one? It's honestly up to your choice. You can even make a pink walk in, right? Yeah, any color you wish. You know what? Maybe you can even make a white walk in. Who knows? Yeah. Okay. What's the next step?
2,000 years later.